Good morning, everyone. I hope you can hear the birds. There's so many birds in Uganda. Did you know that? So, so many. Hi. Another week has gone by, and I wanted to keep you guys updated on everything that's happening over here. And then I think, well, not everything, because there's always so much going on. But thank you guys for praying and, and just keeping us covered. I think there's power in prayer, and I do appreciate it when you pray for us. And I wanted to say, Thank you to everyone who donates on a regular basis so that we can eat and keep the lights on. And then another thank you to people who donate for projects like this one. Um, a cover's been installed over here so that the area can become usable and people can sit out here, uh, study, read, and not have to sit in direct sunlight. It's going to be so nice. We hope to be able to get uh, a bougainvillea to grow up over the top. And so it should be very pretty too. But it'll probably take a couple years. But long-term thinking, right? Update on everything that happened last week. Um, we had movie night. It was a wonderful time. And two people got saved. So thank you guys for praying for that and helping to make that happen. Also, we've been preparing for the round table. The topic this month is going to be, can you lose your salvation? And if you look into it, there's verses for both sides. And so we are going to talk about balance and that the goal is to know Christ better. So please pray. That will be October 14th. Uh, pray for us as we go out to evangelize and invite and that people would come with an open heart to learn with the goal of knowing Jesus better. Um, pretty soon I need to take my second round of Bill Hartsey pills. Um, I don't feel bad. My throat's a little scratchy, but it's allergy season. And I have two prayer requests for the students to have perseverance and that they would put God first in all things. And then Beverly um, found out she has a goiter and it's in her neck, so she needs to go to the U.S. to a surgeon to have that removed. Uh, prayers for her as she tries to get that organized and taken care of. Thank you guys for praying, and I'll talk to you next week.